yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course we are back with another talking about video. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna say talking about video. Uh, I okay, I'm really good. So yeah, um, of course we got a PyCon Internet for celebration is here. Fully on global because my camera is over a little bit. Um, of course we did get the full info right here. Of course full campaign info, full data download, which we full data download. I said full. Wait a second, I probably put it in words today. Um, go back here. Um, full data download, of course, all right here. Uh, we did get the AP Goku, AP Vegeta, um, the game network means as well as Global as well as on JP. I'll leave my JP videos tomorrow on me. Again, I'll blow this as soon as I'm done. I actually want to start doing that like these type of videos, just getting them done out, even though I have, I have a video right for the day, because I upload two videos technically in my pipe, my um, breakdown video for Hit, Revival Blue Goku, and Ultra Super Saiyan Goku for Dark Mode Legends, and of course for Doki, was the Doki Fest video of it. So yes, uh, with all the info and stuff like that for all these guys, the World Tournament stuff will be like this month, so near the end of the month. So we're going to probably have to cross the next celebration by then, so, um, or whatever. Because I know Jiffy's probably going to get like an LR on the 16th, highly, probably because last year during the 16th we did get LR Vegeta and Apple confirmed, so. Yeah, these usually are on like, for me, it's like, what, 9 p.m.? At this time anyway, though. But for Gold Boys, it's like their um, usual like campaign stuff at 8 o'clock, so. Uh, this is how JB time is. Uh, this is global time. It's not global time. It's like 8:30. I just had I was I was um prepping up the thumbnail like for this um PyCon Jeffa celebration. So um took some time. So of course I had like all the stuff. I, I was working on that. Then I was trying to um, get the video. I was setting up the video as well, trying to you know typical YouTube stuff to try to get everything set up. And I was working on the thumbnail a little bit. So I had to do that much as you know when I'm done with it. So I mean it was Jeff was or just going. So yeah um. Of course, we got Dan Dan, we got Pi Country Nipple, we got the full Doku Fest info. Uh, we got also Vecu there, from the, the formable Vecu that's new and stuff like that. So we'll go over him, I pretty much went over and said everything I wanted to say in my video. So I was like, got really nothing to say because I'm still going to do a Doku Fest events. I am trying to do mobile recordings again. And now my new phone is more sufficient now, it's a lot faster, 64 gigabytes. Oh, man. Ugh. That's all that already. So yeah, um, of course we're gonna do Doku Fest. Again, they're not gonna come out the day one, but I'll try to push them out as far as I can. Um, cause again, I, like, I'm doing so much, else, like, I've been so busy off screens so, though, so yeah. And I will do chain battle equipment pulls and stuff like that, so yeah. Um, for like, um, Gohan and stuff like that, cause I, you know, I was like, nah, I'll just go ahead and do it, cause no one ever, some people do it, but at the same time, it's like, I might as well do it. For, for, I was gonna do it for like the end of Dikoku or Angle and Breeze. The so, like, Krillin's legendary campaign will be up as well. Again, that was login bonus special missions. Video cutouts, typical little stupid stuff, it always happens. Every campaign video, man. Literally every campaign video has always happened. Uh, double rewards for, um, or double success, great success. All success for trains are up and double, so yeah. More special missions, massive growth special missions. I feel like they'd be like, oh yeah, Grill has missions right here, so I feel like they kind of really thought that, because mission draws up here. Um, these are just like, you know, special missions for Krillin probably, and stuff like that, they kind of do that. Dragon Stone Sales usually are good for Dual Dual Confessed. Uh, Pagan and Janemba, of course, they're going to have tickets, it is confirmed down there. Ticket, Dual Confessed tickets A and B, they do it for every Dual Dual Confessed unit in the game. Uh, for Global, so we're going to see those discounts, we're going to see, like, you know, um, we're going to see, like, 25, like, the first multi is going to be discounted, the second multi will be discounted. Third one, that's one will be free, of course. Then if you do all those those rotations, um, you'll get, um, you'll get tickets. You got a random amount of tickets. Even if some, even if you summon after that moment, you'll still get a lot of tickets even after that. You'll still summon, you'll still get infinitely tickets and stuff like that, even after you do the discounts. That, um, so yeah, you have a, a long time to do this and stuff like that. As a Dodo Fest banner, the discounts last like a very long time. The Super Bowl discounts. Then after that, it's gonna be 50 stones, like after you know, 25, 45, 35, whatever. Um, those will be gone and it'll only be 50 stones. It'll be, it'll be buy, it's gonna still be buy three, get one free. So yeah, every time you'll do three multis, the fourth one will be free. Every Dodo -Do Fest goes through this, then after that again. And even when you summon, even after the discounts or whatever, um, you still have tickets and stuff like that. So yeah, first multis are discounted. You'll get tickets, you know, you'll get tickets as you summon and stuff like that. Typical little stuff. So, um, yeah. Um, Pycon, um, okay, um, eh. Oh, uh, other kinds of banner. Oh, no, I said Pycon's banner. Pecon's banner, yeah. Um, thank you, Dragon Ball Battle Hour, Battle, Battle Hour, whatever I'm um, supposed called. Um, Battle Hour, you give us Pecon. Yeah, um, of course, this is a pack where you get the Dokkan's ticket A and B for um, Pycon and Geneva's banner, so you can summon and get more, you know, tickets from here. Um, of course, the Dokkan's events are going to be updated for, um, this is never Hoopy Tech. Pycon will be a chill. Like, I was saying he's going to be tech, he's going to be in, um, whatever. So yeah, Elijah Nepha ain't coming, okay. Um, about, or, you know, April Fool's, you know, Pi Goku ain't coming or whatever. Um, crash, car crash, Goku Krillin. And a car, test car, whatever, Krillin. Uh, Ted, um, driver's license Goku no Piccolo for April Fool's. Okay. I mean, yeah, it's weird, it's weird, because this year we didn't get April Fool's unit, April Fool's unit at all. Really weird. 
Um, of course, the Vision Reborn um, event where he can perform a new Beku. He's pretty okay. I didn't really seem to want to talk about him. I might just stop scaring him. Honestly. But we'll be for refreshed, so all enemies will be back. All enemies will be back. Um, they'll be um, not new, but they'll be have like their everything. They'll be refreshed again, so they can do those again. Um, Pycons, of course, the event's gonna come back. From those Pycon hats are actually all really good. Uh, so about Road's gonna be open. Probably Zero gonna go Professor Banner and stuff like that. I think that's how it was on JP. Uh, we can take it. We're gonna be back um, up for this. So it's this kind of shocking. I was like, well, it's been a really long time. It, it's been so long. Um, yeah, Logan Bone special missions, the actual weekend summon tickets. Those be up for a whole entire month. SCR Geneva's ZZA, which we all saw. I was like, because I was in the, the DBZ.space, I was like, wait, what? The DBZ, I mean, I saw it on Doku Wiki, I was like, wait, what? SCR Geneva's ZZA? And I was like, oh yeah, I forgot it came out with the celebration. Because ZZA always had the celebration, so. Um, yeah. Um, I thought we just come back, we can get into Geneva's ZZA. Or the ATL one. Yeah, I would. Um, Pike, um, these are, I think, uh, um, different EZAs and stuff like that are coming back. Yeah, for Pickles events and stuff like that. Just kind of random stuff. I think it came back on JP. It's been so long, but yeah. If you want to get some more guys to perform with those events, really good celebration overall. Again, I was half tired getting to this video. But overall, really good celebration, honestly. You got weekend tickets, you got global discounts, tickets, summons. I about to say you do the discounts, maybe get some good, you can probably get some tickets and summon. Because all the tickets are random once you summon and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, I think it's been, sometimes it's been like three, sometimes it's been like six, sometimes it's been like nine. But I think it's always been three. Uh, for a really long time. I don't know, in my opinion, I think it's always been three. So, um, yeah, though, um, I, uh, okay. Um, I probably say just do the discounts and stuff like that and call it a day, in my opinion. Campaign info and stuff like that. Um, again, celebration's really good and stuff like that. I actually do like it though. Um, I don't know, it's been long enough since I think it's JP1, so it's kind of like, eh, a little bit though. So, um, yeah. But overall, though, celebration's really great. Again, Global's gonna have discounts, tickets. Uh, JP will probably get that later on because they're getting the Pickle of Trove stuff and they'll probably get the same treatment as well. But again, time's recording, which you still do not have the update for JP. So, Pickle of Trove, again, all that stuff will probably, all that stuff. We'll probably come to JP um somewhat after um probably somewhat after like this Fidel celebration maybe because we already got a notice for it in the game it's almost been like a week so it's literally like global when it was broken it was only like, for a week that was it so yeah um of course though like I said um we should get all this again we're getting all this tonight and stuff like that so around like 2 p.m. whatever whatever time uh, I'll upload this or whatever um we should have everything like ready and good to go so yeah. Um, of course, um, Legendary Campaigns, of course, is going to be up. I think Goku Black will, um, event will be coming back, as well as Frieza's, I believe. Uh, all that will be coming back with the celebration, so, um, so I guess you can get Krillin, so you don't have to you know, struggle against Krillin, I guess, because, you know, he's a hero, they're villains, you know, you can form them up and get them done and stuff like that, so yeah. This is all the typical campaign stuff, you get done early, um, you get 10 stones, um, 3 Kai's, of course, um, 2 hour glasses. but if you already have it, like, you know, if you, if the mission is going to be done, like, in-game, I think it should be live already, or when it goes live around like 2.30 game or whatever. Um, we should have everything already good to go for this guy. So, um, again, all you gotta do is like, you know, if the missions go live, all you gotta do is like, does that come back in? Because the game will be notified like, okay, you did everything. So yeah, again, we're getting Krillin to LR and stuff like that. We'll be have to give you 20 stones, 7 cards for SA20, and him, him 100% will give you all those orders, which basically is almost enough to 100% him again. So, um, pretty much it's almost like, I think that's like, what, at least, that has to be at least like what almost 55 percent maybe not 55 percent but that has to be at least like what at least almost 90 100 percent though so yeah of course his, his event will be back up half stamina so you want to go ahead and try to farm him say go ahead he really is a good asset for world tournament if you haven't already done now um that's still pretty good again all the villains will be back and stuff like that we'll have bonuses goku black's event uh freezer's event will be back up as well again typical little stuff so yeah all that will be back up uh, for cooling and stuff like that so yeah though really good um right there I'm um, going stuff like that. Again, Pycon Jimbo, I probably pretty much went over my 4,000 for them. Pycon's really good. He does a lot and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I, again, I say don't really summon for them because they're, I mean, they're really, really good. Pycon's good. His active skill essentially gives him a ghost usher. Um, we get more robot orbs with him or I think a couple more orbs with him. Um, he'll be, um, really, really good. But, um, again, you have to have rainbow orbs and you're not going to have that really prioritize really. But overall though, he's going to be really good. He still does a lot. He's going to dodge, do, um, you know, give himself a lot of attack and defense. Um, Again, we have a couple more, we have like four more key spirits that could be really good. But with Geneva, it's kind of the opposite. You need to key spirits, and you're not going to have that as much. Because 
if you're doing like a full on tech team or specific support items or you know or changes or whatever he'll be good for extreme tech like sort of battle or something like that because i feel like you never know, i like him like concept wise i can do like him concept wise and um i mean the wise i feel like i like him with a pycon but a little bit but i feel like pycon does a lot more than but as time goes on i see this more and more and more again it's like making gold jp videos i can see my thoughts stuff like that change but jp really just reaction we get the gold bomb like Okay, I give my full thoughts and stuff like that because I'm a full cool player. I mean, I do, but I like to, um, you know, I think it's different and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, though, any ghost when you get a partner super attack, which you're going to see a lot with any Angel Goku or Vegeta, you're going to see that. Um, good. But again, lately I have been doing that since, like, they've been on the team or whatever. Like, they had to be on the team to get the item, the, um, super, unit super attack, or, you know, they had to be on the rotation. I think specifically, go any Angel Goku or Vegeta can be on the rotation. But yeah, Zebra, I feel like I'm more impressed with after he transforms. But before he transforms, the a suppressive being it kind of like cooler. But after he transforms, um, um, he just goes ball, just goes freaking everything. He just goes like just balling nuts over us, got everybody. So yeah, he's really, really good at the transforms. I really was impressed when you guys um, updated, like when this came out for Gold Bones, or JP and stuff like that. But it really came out back in like December. So yeah, really impressed, really good with this guy and stuff like that. Um, really, really good though. But again, you had to have, I think, a couple more Ember Orbs slash. I think tech orbs, I believe. No, you don't. This is rainbow orbs. So yeah, again, Pagan Jimber can be fine with rainbow orbs, like you know, tomorrow. But you're not gonna really gotta see that because you're not gonna have like four or five rainbow orbs in a row. Unless you get super, super lucky with rainbow orb changers. Yeah, you're not gonna see that, like second part face on this part of this passive or whatever. So you're not gonna dodge. You're not gonna get yourself a little bit more attack, of course. Um, you're not gonna dodge and yeah, you yourself. Yeah, you're not gonna pretty much dodge and stuff like that. Or rainbow key for just give him like you know because he's probably gonna dodge either way. You give him like four dodge or whatever. But, yeah. Um, but yeah, though, um, Vecu pretty much went over. I didn't really see anybody ever really talk about Vecu, though. Uh, I guess he's pretty okay, but he does kill his own. Um, he has, like, you know, he does kill, like, his own attack, uh, twice, essentially, though, so... That's not really good for everybody. You know, again, we, we've seen Unit B design way better. I don't know what's this guy's excuse. Again, I probably use him in game. I'm like, oh yeah, he's good, but just don't look good. He does have a cool, unique animation. He fucks on the enemy, but still. Um, I never really see everybody really talk about this guy that much anymore, though. But um, I guess he seems pretty solid. I guess okay, maybe. I so I don't know. So um, haven't really seen that much of this guy as much. So yeah, I mean, well, he's gonna be a good, I guess, we play unit though. But he's gonna be like the best. I don't know. So yeah. Uh, I think Ape Goku and Ape Vegeta, they're pretty much both the same unit and stuff like that. Again, same little skill, just, you know, op opposite typings and stuff like that, you know. Um, no, they're not opposite. I mean, yeah, opposite typings, different typings, whatever. Pretty much both the same unit. I think Vegeta's gonna be a little bit better for more categories. Goku have any? Yeah. They're both, again, they're both really gonna be pretty good. I've seen Vegeta a little bit better. I've seen um, Goku a little bit better. But yeah. Of course, that's your agenda is going to get his easy. I'm going to talk about him more when he comes out and stuff like that. I'll probably go full easy. I might actually do a mobile video for this guy. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it though, because I always usually do like the desktop version of this. Um, I might do it for mobile, just do something different. I might. I don't know. I'm still kind of debating. But he can stack his dodge and stuff like that. He can, he can stack dodge, evade. Um, once he's stacking, he starts stacking his dodge. Again, really good for like the go good event, but it's going to be bad in the end. So, yeah. Again, these are the Pycon and Demba banners. I will probably go over them more and more and more when they come out, because I am going to do most of the videos for these guys. Banners are great. Again, you're going to have discounts, coins, all that stuff, but I don't say something right now. Save for the anniversary is way more important. I'm going to say that 5,000 times. Yeah, it's pretty much it for the campaign, though. Again, Pycon, Janembo, we got um, lots of new global stuff, so we're better roads open a lot. Um, Primer Ayo Krimskin is, of course, you know, legendary event. Pycon, Janembo, both really good. Good to talk about more later, so yeah. See you guys at ABG Goku, ABG Vegeta, again, the ECA, even though already came out on JP. Yeah, download. See you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great. I'll go do it again though. Make sure stay safe. Wash your hands. God bless. I'll be going up when we're masked. So what you guys think about all this stuff? Do you like it? Do you hate it? I think it's great. Good effort. Um, yeah, your last hope of getting your Doka Fest PyCon ever again, or an LR. I'm kidding though, but yeah. Really good celebration. I like it. I think it's great. Gonna talk about more later videos from mobile and blah 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 blah